Okay, so let's just start reviewing this program. This is Sun School Spanish book one and I purchased this program because I work outside. I was looking for something that helps me a little bit when it comes to Spanish and I thought that this was going to be good because it has uh, some CDs and music that it was going to accompany the program. I am not that fond of the program and my son didn't enjoy the program and we are in the beginning of the program because of that reason. I think I would like to continue using it until we finish with the program, but we didn't enjoy it. I'm not going to bash the company or saying anything, you know, that will just hurt them as a company. I think I see the good intentions with the program but it didn't work for us. I am looking for something that is going to continue teaching my son phonetically Spanish. I think that is the best way when you're teaching the language that you start phonetically and Spanish is one of those languages that I think that it should follow almost like the same as when you are trying to speak English, that you are teaching your kids phonetically those sounds. I think Spanish should be the same way. And that is something that I expressed in a previous video, is the program that I've been using for my kid to teach my kid Spanish. It's a program that does not have a CD, it's just a simple book that cost me $10. And it's been helping us when it comes to Spanish, but I was looking for something that when I was at work, he was going to be able to work a little bit more independent. I thought this was going to be the solution, but it's not. He hasn't enjoyed the music, he hasn't enjoyed the sound, and if you want me to be honest, I haven't enjoyed that neither. I am not so happy with the way that the program teaches certain things when it comes to Spanish. And as a Spanish being my first language, it's a little bit more complicated for me because Obviously, I am going to be a little bit more picky when it comes to the programs that we're going to be using for Spanish. So I think I would like to continue with this program without the use of the music and the DVDs. I am not fond of that. I think that it was a better way to explain certain uh, things, certain words uh, in Spanish. I just didn't like it. I am I'm I am not sure if it's the fact that I speak Spanish. I am looking for something more and I felt like it was falling short. And I think that I will just again would like to continue using it as something to you know help us when it comes to the writing that is in here but with the DVDs and the CDs I think it's it's not something that I am looking forward to continue using and he's not looking forward to continue using. I would like to continue using La Cartilla Fonetica. It costs $10. It's simple and it starts teaching Spanish phonetically, which I think that's the best way to do it because it's easy for the kid to retain and keep it here in their memory, correct? I think that when you just start teaching them words in Spanish here and there, yes, they might retain something, but I think at some point, if they, if they don't continue practicing that, it's easy for them to forget. Because as I always express, I think that teaching them starting by the phonetical sounds and the blends is something that is crucial when it comes to learn a, a, a language. So you're learning it, the correct way, which is for me the correct way, which is just starting with those phonetical sounds, making sure that you understand that very well, and then moving to what will be learning some words, you know, the alphabet, all of that. I feel like it was just lacking that, and it was lacking the practice. I feel like the DVDs were not going very well with the lesson. It was just some words here and there and the way that they just lay out that to go with the with the writing part of the program it, it just feels like it's not coherent it doesn't go together for some reason it, it was just lacking 
I don't know, I can't even explain. It's just for me as a Spanish speaker, being Spanish my first language, I think that it was just lacking. I feel that when you're looking for a program, I feel that sometimes we can get very excited. We see somebody using the program and it works for them and you want to try and that's what I did. I try, it didn't work for us, that does not mean that it's a bad program. It's just, it's not what I am looking for when it comes to Spanish. I am looking for a program that is going to teach my son phonetically, teaching him those blending sounds. When it comes to Spanish, the vowels, and I feel like this was not the program. And while it does teach the vowels and it goes through the alphabet, I think that it was not in the order in which I think it should be, in which I think it should happen. I feel like you should start with the vowels, which is easier, and then move on towards the blendings. And after that, you can start teaching them some words because I think it's easy for them to retain everything like that. And use pictures, you see just materials that are going to be helpful, uh, maybe having them, yes, write, Having a place for them to write is helpful, but it's just the way that everything was organized, the layout of the program is just not working for me and for my kids. So the book that I would like to continue using will be Nuestra Cartilla Fonética. I think this book is working very well for us. It only cost me $10. I have all the resources that I will be sharing with you guys. I know I've been saying that quite constantly, but I am looking for a way that I am able to share that with you guys that will keep my privacy intact, obviously. And it's taking me a long time because while, yeah, I might look like I know a lot about uh, systems and I don't. So it's taking me a little bit of time and we were sick as well. So that took us a little bit of time, but I do like the fact that it starts with the vowels, you are going to review those vowel sounds with your keys. So, a, e, i, o, u, a, e, i, o, u, a, arbor, a, avión, a, aguacate. It's easy for them to retain that information because it goes in an order, which is something that I really like. So, it is a simple book, but it works very well for us. Then you go through the once they learn those vocales, vowels, they go through the blending sounds, which is helpful. And they will go through those blending sounds. I, I, a, au, ua, au, oa, I, just like that. And it's easy for them to retain that information. And it's easy for them to be able to read because they already have that knowledge of the blending sounds. It's just making the ear accustomed to what you guys are practicing, correct? To those sounds. It's almost just as learning the English language. At least I can just express that because obviously I am still learning English and I am still reviewing those uh, phonetical sounds myself. And I know it's goes through almost the same pattern, correct? So I feel like just using this book so far is being helpful, even though it does not have a CD. But if you are a English speaking person, you English is your first language, you want to have something that might help you a little bit to just know how to make those sounds properly. The good thing is that in Spanish, very rare, you're going to find a word that has more than one meaning <laughs> or a lot of sounds. I feel like it's easy to learn the Spanish language because of that. It is a simple program and it goes through those sounds, phonetical sounds, and it's easy for them to see. They, it has a, a better look of where that force of intonation goes. So I think it's helpful as well because of that. So 
I want to continue with La Cartilla Phonetica, which is what we've been using. Until I find something that will be helpful and can help me a little bit while I am at work that he can work a little bit independent when it comes to Spanish. If not, I think I would like to continue with La Cartilla Phonetica. I have seen already a few programs that goes through Spanish a little bit phonetically, not exactly as I want, but somewhere in there. I would like to share those with you guys eventually. But just to let you know what we think about Sound School Spanish is that we're going to finish the program and after that I would like to just stop using it and see what we can do when it comes to Spanish for those days where I cannot be with my kid constantly just reviewing how his pronunciation is going. So far we continue practicing with La Cartilla Phonetica and it's working very well for us so that is something that I like about that. It's simple to use, it's just one book and it's easy for me to do it with him. Yes, I have to create some of the materials that I am going to be using, but at the same time, I prefer to do that than just having him listening to something that I think is going to confuse him more than what is going to be helping him. So I hope you guys enjoy this video. I hope you enjoy this review. I am not batching the company. I'm just stating how that program works for us. That doesn't mean that it's not going to work for you. Maybe you're looking for something simple. You're not really looking for them to learn Spanish completely. You just want to, for them to know the basics. So if you are looking for that, I think that is a good program. But if you want something that is really going in depth when it comes to learning Spanish, you want them to learn properly Spanish, meaning grammar, writing, conversational. I think that's not the best program for that. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, please don't forget to hit like, comment, and subscribe to my channel. I will see you then. Bye-bye.